Hi guys, Postman's Bin. Some people ask why I blank out my address. Well, quite simple. I don't want all sorts of spam junk being sent to me. The other thing I do is I scan these things, the QR code and that, just to check that those don't actually give my address away as well. Because Royal Mail ones actually give you the full address there. But these don't. That one says what it says there, and that one says what it says there. So I've checked them already. Anyway, the guy was a bit worried. He knocked on the door, wanted me to check, because the box was broken. That bit was missing. I ripped it open to check that everything was still in there. Well, there we go. I've got a couple more LiPo batteries. I was watching one of my old videos, very old videos, where I was saying I didn't want to get involved in LiPo batteries because of the potential problems with them. Catching fire and storage and having to buy chargers for them and all that sort of thing. And somehow or other over the years I seem to have drifted into it. So that's a couple of 3S Florion 2200 milliamp hour batteries. I suppose we better check they're actually inside. Can't even get the box open. Okay, so that looks like a battery. Comes with a little strap as well, that's nice. And the right connector for what I want. once over. They look okay at the moment. That's for little projects like that one. I've got 3S LiPo on there. Right, and then the other thing is another dash camera for the car. Oh, it's been damaged as well. Because the one that I've got doesn't charge the battery very well. It does sometimes. If you tap it a bit, gently, then the battery does start charging. So there's obviously something a bit loose inside. I have taken it apart before and adjusted things. But it's not a very high quality one. You really can't read number plates on it, that sort of thing. So I was looking for another relatively cheap one. I think this was about 30 quid, thereabouts, a bit more, but not much more, so it's still a relatively cheap one. That's not a very robust looking connector. Oh well, we'll find out when we stick it in the car. USB, HDMI. Charger. Hopefully I can use the one that I've already got in the car. That's all nicely behind the bodywork out the way. I wonder if it's got any power in it at the moment. 
that looks like on off. Yeah, blue light's coming on. Uh, well, it did come on. Battery low. Okay, well, I'll stick that on charge and then I'll put it in the car. And we might have a video later on, see what sort of picture we get out of it. Still, that's today's post bag. Hey, thanks for watching. There's plenty of videos on my main channel with more added daily. So don't forget to subscribe and enable the notifications to keep you up to date with my new releases. You can help keep my channel running by donating a dollar on Patreon to buy me coffee. You can always find more information in the video description. Thanks again for watching.